Don't forget to subscribe. We had no foreknowledge of, did not consent to, and do not endorse or approve any footage or audio from air being repurposed by the Trump campaign, artists' equity say in a statement. Donald Trump's use of air audio for a campaign video was out of bounds, says Matt Damon in Ben Affleck's production company. Artists' Equity the production company co-founded by the actors, who both star in and produce the Affleck-directed sports drama centered on Nike's creative partnership pursuit of basketball star Michael Jordan says in a statement released to news source that they did not consent to. Trump's use of the audio in a promotional video shared on his social media platform Truth Social late Friday. We had no foreknowledge of did not consent to and do not endorse or approve any footage or audio from air being repurposed by the Trump campaign as a political advertisement or for any other use, a spokesperson says. Specifically in terms of any and all rights available to us under us copyright and intellectual property law, we hereby expressly give notice that in the case of any use of material from air by the Trump campaign where approval or consent is required, we do not grant such consent. M. In a nearly three-minute clip, Trump repurposes a critical speech that Sonny Vaccaro played by Damon delivers to Jordan Damian Delano Young predicting the ways in which he'll change the world of basketball. Money can buy you almost anything, but it can't buy you immortality that you'll have to earn, Damon's Vaccaro says, as Trump enters the frame to tell his American story, footage of his rallies and headlines about his indictment are interspersed to nearly all of Damon's monologue. When the time here passes, everyone will be forgotten except you, Damon's speech continues. Some things are eternal, so you will be remembered forever. According to major news, the former U.S. president has been charged in the past week with seven charges related to the handling of classified documents, including violating the Espionage Act, keeping secrets of defense secrets, making false statements, and conspiring to obstruct justice. Indicted, the sources claiming her innocence are the first ever former US president to face federal indictment. He is expected to surrender on Tuesday. The Trump campaign has borrowed musicians, TV shows, and movies without permission, resulting in several Game of Thrones references, Tom Petty and Prince, and HBO for Queen and Neil's legacy. It led to denunciations and multiple cease and desist orders of copyright owners, especially Young, 